Mira is an integrated mobile phone channel which provides high quality consistent health communication tool to rural women and connect them with nodal health service delivery system under the Millennium Alliance Award 2 Mira won the scale up program for low income countries in this scale up Mira is being adapted and piloted as an innovative impact project from India to Uganda and Afghanistan It is based on RMNCH plus A approach which is reproductive maternal child newborn health and for adults and girls and uh, this project has been the winner of Millennium One Alliance project and we have implemented this program in the district of Mewat in Haryana and we are able to reach out to almost 300,000 women through SSGs and through uh, also we had set up our own MIRA workers who are working in different villages and were able to reach to women on a weekly basis and now this project is being adapted and piloting in, uh, uh, in LIC countries, in low income countries, in Uganda and Afghanistan. Mira uses iconic communication strategy with audio support making the channel an interactive talking toolkit. It is designed for millions of semi-illiterate and unreached women. The key objective of Mira in Uganda and Afghanistan is focused towards reducing maternal mortality rates and infant mortality rates in Afghanistan. Mira channel provides integrated health communication, management and service delivery for maternal and child health, reaching to the last woman in the rural settings. The toolkit leverages the reach of mobile phones by provisioning appropriate tools for prenatal care, child immunization, newborn care, family planning and adolescent girl health to provide consistent information and connect them with public health services to improve the health indicators. We have already identified different steps how we are going to implement the project in these countries. Uh, our first phase is the inception phase where we have established partnership with the government and also now we are looking for a right geographical area in Afghanistan and Uganda. In the second phase we will be doing the re-adaptation of technology based on the local context. In the third phase we will be doing the training the testing of the program in the communities and in the fourth phase we will have a one year implementation program both in Afghanistan and Uganda and at the end of the project we will be doing the monitoring and implementation of the program and see what is the success of the program how it is being adopted by the government or the state there and how we can scale up those programs not only in Afghanistan and Uganda but in other low income countries. Maternal mortality rates and infant mortality rates in Afghanistan and Uganda are equally bad or even worse than India. In Uganda, MMR is 360 and IMR is 45, whereas only 43 of women opt for traditional method of home-based delivery and only 57% of births are assisted by skilled health workers. The MIRA project bridges the gap in information decision-making and timely service delivery. The project proposes to adapt and test its India model in Uganda to improve MCH indicators in there. <music> 